And millions are dealing with bone chilling temperatures this morning, including our Alex Perez in Chicago, where they dropped to single digits overnight. Alex, good morning. Hey there, Diane. Well, this stubborn Arctic blast just will not loosen its grip on the Midwest. I want you to take a look behind me here. This field of snow that you're looking at, well, it's actually not a field of snow. It's Lake Michigan that's frozen over in this area here, blanketed with snow. Now, we've had several days of below freezing temperatures, and because of that, the ice just continues to build. We're also, of course, seeing ice-coated roadways across the region and that is creating some big problems, making driving for a lot of people a nightmare. Some people are dealing with temperatures that feel like anywhere from 30 to 50 below zero. And of course, with those, uh, that extreme cold also comes the extreme danger. Frostbite can begin to set on exposed skin in as little as five minutes. Now, to make matters worse, Diane, there's more snow expected here in Chicago and other areas today and later this week. Now, to give you an idea of just how we're coping with this, well, we're not outside for very long. I have several layers on, three hats, and I'm also working with battery-operated heat, heated gloves, heated hat, heated socks, and I'm still feeling the cold. We're getting inside uh, as soon as we can. Diane? All right, Alex, let's let you go warm up. Thank you. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.